You have just acquired your new M box. Plug the HDMI cord in the back and then plug it in the TV. Plug in your power cord to the box. Then you're going to want to find which HDMI input. Some TVs are labeled so you can verify easy. Here's your home screen to your M box. First thing you want to do here is your navigation. This is your back button. This is the home button. We want to navigate to the settings and enter your Wi-Fi address. Once that is done and connected, click your home button on your remote. Down here, you have Facebook, Cody, Google Play, Pandora. You also have more apps that you can put on your front page. You can also add more to your library by go, going to Google Play. For all your TV and movie needs, go to Cody. There is no need for Netflix or Hulu or Amazon Prime. Everything you will ever need to watch is on your Cody. This is a pop-up saying it's been updated. You can just dismiss it. Usually at first startup, you want to give it a few minutes. In the bottom right corner, you would see pop-up saying updated. For best movie or TV shows, Exodus is highly recommended. Here, you can search by genre, year, which goes all the way down to 1965. Every movie within 1965 to now is in your library. You notice there's an in theater section. All the movies that are currently in theaters will also be in your library. But be warned, quality is limited. Usually camera. The longer it stays on your program, the better the quality gets in time. All other movies that are not in theater are in your highest definition. So I just pulled up Suicide Squad. Here, you have 443 streams of the same movie to choose from. You notice the quality at the end of the file. Let's go ahead and pick a stream and see if it comes on. Some streams play better than others. Here we have Suicide Squad, still in theaters, on your TV. With your navigation on your remote, click the back button and it'll exit you out of your movie. If you click all the way to the left, this little sidebar pops out and you can change the view of how you browse. I prefer a thumbnail. A 
Let's go ahead and go out. TV show section, Exodus. Here you can also browse by what aired today. Network specific. And what everybody's watching. Once you click on a show, you have every season and every episode from beginning to current. And typically the shows air two hours before it airs specific time. Click the back button to go to the previous page you were on before. Here we have sports. Sports Devil is one of the oldest apps which is on every program. Click on that, go to live sports, go down to firstrowsports.eu. Here you have all of the sports. American football, NFL, UFC, WWE, that's your pay-per-view, soccer, basketball, hockey, baseball, and so on. Being today is Sunday, here's all the Sunday football games. Lions and Rams, Pittsburgh and Dolphins, look at all that. Workout, Insanity, Yoga, Arnold Schwarzenegger, all at your fingertips, Kids, Cartoon Crazy has every cartoon. I'm talking the 60s, Fantastic Four, Thundercats, Mon Chi Chi's, it's endless. You can watch... Dukes of Hazard on cartoon. It's crazy. Disney. Every single Disney movie from 1930 to now. You can get live TV. You just got to possibly YouTube for instructions. I'm still working on that. Adult. You can be found in the video add-on section. It's self-explanatory. Each one says 18 or over or triple X. And you have all the unlocked websites. Here's how we do maintenance. Program section. Go to Aries Wizard and click on it. It'll do a quick update. If it's longer than that, usually it's updating your build and it would ask you to restart your Kodi. But after it does the update, give it a second, this page pops up. You wanna go here to maintenance. Here, you can see the stop signals once it's in red, you'll have to delete, and it only takes a second. What that does is it clears up all the free space that is preventing your movie or show from playing completely without pausing or kicking you out. Temporary files, every time it updates, it brings up garbage that you have to empty. It's the price we pay for free TV. Down here, you can make it to automatically empty everything or over here you can set up a weekly daily or monthly reminder for you to check your maintenance so here's your new inbox unlimited access to the world's media you can go by language you can search by region country, it doesn't matter, 
As long as it's on the internet, you can watch it from your TV. Thank you, and I hope you enjoy your new Mbox.